Hi, welcome to the Hillsview Active Living Center in Georgetown. My name is Matt and today as part of the food program provided by the Lynn, we're going to be making ham and cheese egg bites. These are a really great breakfast item. You can store them in the fridge for a few days or throw them in the freezer to reheat later. So for this recipe, we only need a few ingredients. They're super simple and easy to find. We need about one small onion, uh, roughly chopped, half a red pepper, uh, about three green onions diced up, half a cup of ham. This is canned ham, but I encourage you to use one of the Schneider loaves, uh, about a half cup of shredded cheddar cheese, two tablespoons of milk, six eggs, and a little bit of olive oil, and then salt to taste. So when your oil is nice and hot, we're gonna add the onions first. Give that a stir. When your onions are translucent, we're gonna add your ham and the red pepper. Give that a stir. Let the ham brown up and the red peppers get a little soft. While the ham and onions are cooking, we're gonna take our six eggs in a bowl, add our cheese and our green onions, two tablespoons of milk, one, two, some salt to taste, and then we're going to whisk it up until it's nice and frothy. So when your ham and onions are nicely browned like they are now, we're going to add them to the egg mixture. And then we're going to stir that in. Next, we're gonna take our egg mixture and we're gonna add it to our uh, greased muffin tin. You only wanna fill these about three quarters of the way full. Next, we're gonna put it in the oven for about 15 minutes at 350. Once they're golden brown, they're done. We're gonna pull them out and let them sit for 10 minutes before we try to remove them. And there you have it, ham and cheese egg bites. These are a really easy breakfast option. They can be stored in the refrigerator or frozen and reheated later. You can really do whatever you want with these. You can add bacon and gouda, chicken and goat cheese, or if you wanna make it a little spicier, you can add in some jalapenos. Enjoy.